Yes, my internet family, we're talking about change, or you have to change to survive. When I come into the United States of America, I was a tailor. But as time goes by, most of the dry cleaning store, they shut down. Most of the tailor shop, they shut down. And people, people not doing custom made, custom made clothes here in the United States much. All the clothes made in Taiwan, Japan, and all of those, Korea, and all of those places. And they come into the United States. So I have to go back to school, my in-laws and my family told me. And I went back and I learned nursing. And I worked in that field for many years. But now as I got older, it reached the place where they are now giving us 15 patients, 16 patients, 17, 18 patients. Every time they give you two dollar raise, they give you two extra patients. And I say go on and go on till, and if somebody don't come to work, even though you have 18 patients, they shear up his 18 patients, give to you. You have to do a certain amount of that 18 patient. And they reach to a place where at my age I can't do it no more. So I have to go back to school. One time I go back to school and I study diesel mechanic. You see, I'm talking about changing yourself, changing your mindset. Go back to school, I study diesel mechanic and I work on it for a few years. We reach a place in the cab and pick up one of them, the alternator. So I went back to school and I study security enforcement. And I'm doing it now in my 70s. Okay. But you reach a place where I sometimes have to ask myself, how long can I do that job? How long? Because you have to be awake. You have to be alert. You have to pay attention. You might not even come back home alive if you not if you don't have your high hope, if you're not paying attention. So when I realized, I realized that I have to go back to school in my 70s. I have to go back to school to learn different skills that I can work right from my home, in the comfort of my home with my computers, and I don't have to go out there. I don't have to have no big, no big dog talking down to me. I don't, I don't have to have nobody abusing me. We're talking about change. You have to see, the, see that the road is changing, turning.